Morning guys, got a message from Tim Field this morning that the uh, the pitch is starting today so I'm going to make my way down there. I'm super excited about this, just can't wait to video it for you guys. I'll make some nice videos, find out what's going on. I'll post it in my blog later. Uh, I'm super excited, Blackpool are back. So at the moment we're taking off the top layer down there and this is going down that side. Look, I'm here with Harry. <laughs> What's the plan? Tell us all about it. You're taking off the top so at the basically moment. Basically what's going on now is the top layer is getting removed, which removes all vegetation and organic matter that's grown over the season or two. Is these, these organic nematodes or something they keep going on about? <laughs> no, <laughs> nematodes are a seasonal thing. You get them in every football pitch, really. All right, okay. So the top layer is going to come off and then... How far are we taking off? Is just this layer now, or does it go deeper? Uh, pro pro probably deeper, but I say after the next processes, it'll look a, bit, a lot better than it does now. Right, and how long will this take? You think? Now I think we'll have grass back on the pitch in a few weeks' time. In a few weeks? Yeah. There we are. Brilliant. Thank you, Harry. Thanks You're for welcome. your time. Yeah. I'm also with David. David, and you're are you part of the ground staff? Yeah, I'm part of the ground staff. I Did mainly look after the training grounds. You may look after. Oh, well, that's an odd that's job, isn't job. it? Yeah, that's a job. <laughs> so we need a new training ground, don't we? We're, we're, we're going to do some work over the summer um, yeah. to improve the pitches because that's what Terry wants for the lads over the summer. That's brilliant. Yeah, so it's a good positive start. So what are you doing here? You're not driving the tractors or anything, are you? Ooh. No, no, I'm just overseeing things with Harry and just helping out keeping people off the car park so the tractors can get through and get the stuff on the pitch and get the stuff off the pitch. Brilliant. You're doing a good job. Thank yeah, you very much. Pete Wilson and you're from Chapel Hill Sports today. What's going on? What we're going to do today, uh, we're going to remove the total sward of grass. That's every blade of grass in the plant out and into the car park. Um, it's called a Coral Field Top Maker. You can liken that to a road plane, taking as much as you like off basically. Um, the next stage what we're going to do is we're going to re-level the pitch. Um, we have some ups and downs in the pitch that we're going to straighten out. Um, yeah. Then what we'll do is we'll stir the field up, um, right. basically like a farmer does with his, his ploughed fields. Yeah. Um, and then we'll add, add new material into that. Uh, I think we have hundred and around 180 tonne, 200 tonne of material to go into this. And What's that, so that soil? That's fibre sand, which is 80% sand and 20% soil, mixed right. all mixed together. Yeah. Then what we do is we, we mix that into the surface, um, get it to a, a happy medium that's all mixed together and the fibres are all distri distributed properly. Yeah. And then what we do is we um, we consolidate the pitch again. Um, we wheel the pitch back down basically, make it yeah. solid again. And then we have a rake that goes on the back of the tractor, a four metre wide rake, and that gets you back to your, your, your final level basically. Right, um, okay. we do two, It'll be two, perfectly two, level when it's all yeah, done. Yeah, yeah, we do two to three passes with that to trim the top and get it get it fine and, and like a fine seed bed. Yeah. And then what we do is we put down I think around about 20 bags of seed to go on this, of brand new seed, so it'll be a total what sort new of seed pitch. seed is it? It's like a it's seed that just, it's, it's, a, it's a ryegrass, it's a, a, strength, a strong um, seed. That's basically all we try and use in, in football is ryegrass. Um, yeah. You do get the meadow grasses creeping in, which is the shallow stuff that kicks out really easy. Yeah. This is why we take the grass away from the end of the season and start again fresh. Oh, okay. um, and then what we do is we'll put the seed down and give it give it five to seven days. We'll start to see new grass there, uh, and it'll be a total new field. That, from that quick? That's amazing. Yep. Yep. You're doing lots of other grass. Well. Yeah, we're all over the country. We're, we're a nationwide country at the minute, and uh, we do we do all sorts of clubs. Sheffield Wednesday, please. Sorry. Yeah, we're at that Fleetwood at the minute. Another team at Fleetwood at the minute. And then uh, we have Sheffield Wednesday, that's done. Um, we're down to Exeter, that's finished as well. Colchester to do, Leeds United to do. Um, Rochdale, a, a lot of local clubs to do as well. Wow. Um, Rochdale so, only had that new pitch put down. Yeah, a new carpet well. pitch. Yeah, yeah. Has, has that all got to come up as well? That could be just a fine renovation for that right. one. Yeah, just, so this is like a full. A full yeah, job this is the full renovation. This is as far as you can go, basically, right, without so. without digging a half a meter out and putting all new drains in and everything. Million pound to do that, which I 
can't see the club's got to, to do that at the moment. No, no. Well, this um, is as good as we're going to get. This, is this the should best. give us a good pitch. This will give you a brand new pitch for we next season. We won't be long balls like we No, were. no, no. This will no. be a nice brand new pitch for next season. Thank you very much. And, that, uh, thanks for your work. We do no appreciate problem. it. Thank no you. problem. We're getting down to soil now, you yep. can see there. There is, there is patches over there, lads. We just showed us here, look where this, but this is, we're gonna go down deeper on this and take all, get rid of all that. We're gonna be right down to soil, are we, yep. at the end? back to the soil. Total swarm of grass removed. Right. Maker. Yeah. This is so a... You can liken this to a road plane. Takes yep. off the amount that you want it to take off, um, certain depths. Yeah. Into the trailer and out into the cabinet. Right, right. So, so we take it up, that drags it all off there. Yeah. It's a Coro FTM. Oh, FTM and it goes up there and it all goes into your other guy. And oh. those are the rotors inside. Oh, those are the rotors inside. Oh, neck. There we are, guys. Working hard for you, these guys. I tell you, they're yeah. going to do a good job. There you go guys that tells you everything you need to know um, we now know the things I found out down there one this this concrete thing in that corner seems to be it doesn't seem like that that's true they said down there to me don't know where that's come from then they're not aware of concrete under that corner so I think that's maybe just some some hearsay or something that that other groundsman was saying to uh, I don't know but but anyway we're getting a full renovation job as, as you've heard um we're getting down the best seed these guys do loads of football clubs they're gonna you know flatten it all out it's gonna be super smooth i think it's gonna be a much better pitch next season and maybe when they get you know all the new owners come in and they've got the money to invest on a real amazing pitch i would like to see you know we want to you know that plastic stuff they're mixing with the grass and everything i'd like to see that done and, and, and maybe the drainage done next season but it seems like we're gonna have a much much better pitch next season season so fingers crossed this is all going to work and it's going to be brilliant thanks for watching hope you really enjoy this video if you do enjoy this video just make sure you you know you click the subscribe button and also if you just touch that little bell that will give you um, it, it will notify you every time I do a new video so you don't have to keep looking it will just come up you know you, you just be told them I'm, I'm doing a new video uh, and I'll just keep you guys as informed as I can of anything that's going on down at Bloomfield Road uh, as we prepare ourselves for a uh, what I think is going to be uh, great times are coming at, at Bluefield Road. So until the next video, hope you enjoy this one. See you in the next one. Peace!